Greetings. Today we'll be replacing a screen. For this one has seen many a better day. You won't need too many tools for this. This here is a screen tool. They're like five to six bucks at the hardware store. And what I'm trying to do here is trying to pry up the spline holding the screen. Now, depending on the condition of your spline, it may either come apart owing to it having a ton of UV damage and being old, or if it's still fresh enough, it may come out in one piece like this. If it does come out in one piece, lucky you, you won't have to replace it. But if you do, take the old spline with you to the hardware store because they come in different sizes. Once the spline is out, the screen comes out as well. From here, lay your replacement screen on top of the frame, and you will want to leave ample spacing on all sides because when you apply the spline and press it back in, it's actually going to suck some of the screen into itself. And to press it in, this is where this pizza roller looking tool is going to come in handy. I use the roller portion of it to press the spline into the gap. As you do, you can see how it kind of sucks the screen into the frame. Now this tool is quite primitive and I would caution against using it like a pizza roller because if you do, the chances of you slipping and damaging the screen actually are fairly high and if you damage the screen, you might as well start all over again. So instead I just do it stepwise, I just move like an inch at a time and press the spline into the frame piece by piece as to avoid any potential for slipping and then perforating the screen. Once you've gone all around the perimeter and pressed the spline into the frame, just use a box cutter knife and cut around the outside edge of the spline to get rid of any excess screen. Once that's done, just give it one last inspection before putting it back into the window as to remove any excess stringers or making sure that there is no part of the spline that's sticking out. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.